according to the chairperson of the forum, Christine Nechimuero, also woman representative for Chiboga District. The newly constituted forum's main objectives are to increase and sustain parliamentary participation in advocacy, reposition parliamentary roles for the fulfillment of equitable land rights, and also ensure enactment of inclusive, resilient, and gender-sensitive laws, policies in Uganda. We want to ensure the enactment of inclusive laws. And we also want to provide an interface for dialogue. For example, if your community now has a land dispute and you would like members of parliament to come in an organized way, so we are going to use our oversight role, uh, especially in identifying, for example, which disputes are common in all parts of Uganda. This forum is the first of its kind in parliament, and it has 100 legislators as members. It's voluntary, bipartisan platform for members to legislate initiatives on land management in the country. Some of the members of the forum say it is timely because of the contentious proposals for compulsory land acquisition by government. Compensation has to be there. When you read it only in I'm parts before. and you don't conclude that articles, then somehow somebody may think the government has all the right to take your land without proper compensating you and proper timely as well. Should be timely at the same time properly. The forum will also put up a central registry at parliament to compile all land related issues from fellow MPs from their constituencies. I will believe this platform is going to be of great importance to majorly the most vulnerable Ugandans who have been affected by land grabbing, land evictions, illegal land evictions. Even when we look at all these existing government programs, you've heard of circles, you've heard of issues to do with social economic transformation, there is nothing that can prosper if the land question is not addressed. Nachimoro says the forum will work hand in hand with different stakeholders in the land sector, including the Ministry of Lands, Housing and Urban Development, Uganda Land Commission, and Culture Institutions, among others. Shamem Naiga and Gloria Gwitabinji, Parliament.